first, a nude photo, now sexually charged messages. New pressure tonight for U.S. Representative Joe Barton to step down. The congressman from Menace confirms those messages are real. They were sent to an Arlington woman four to five years ago, and tonight, that woman is sharing those messages with our Todd Unger. Hi there. If Republican Representative Joe Barton thought a nude image of himself circulating on the internet last week was a big problem, then he probably isn't liking this week much more. That means there's a pattern here, and that means he's not being completely honest. Kelly Cannon is a longtime GOP mover and shaker in Arlington. Oh, he kept reassuring me in 25 years. Five years ago, she started casually exchanging Facebook messages with uh, Barton, her rep in D.C. Uh, above board, professional, uh, or just two friends talking to each other. But then there are these exchanges. Barton writing, quote, so that means you are wearing a tank top only and no panties? Right now? Kelly responds, okay, that's enough. You know my attire. Good night, to which Barton says, answer me, Miss Evasive, and then you can ask me. Shocked that he would say something like that, and I would just shut it down, because I could tell what he was trying to do, and I wasn't going to have anything to do with it. In another message, the longest-serving Texas member of Congress calls Kelly soft and curvy. In another, acknowledges he's married, and in yet another, writes, quote, want to tell me what you are wearing or not wearing tonight, Miss Sweet Dreams. I mean, we go back. Oh. Kelly says the sexual nature and innuendo were unprovoked each time. She's speaking out now because she thinks Barton has failed to fully apologize and admit wrongdoing when it comes to that nude image, even though the circulation of it is being investigated by authorities as a possible revenge porn case. I think we've seen enough and we don't want to see any more. Literally. Literally. Now we should point out Barton did apologize for that photo last week, but we haven't heard a peep from his office today, even though we reached out to them multiple times. Again, he did confirm to our partners at the Star Telegram, though, that the messages are real. We should point out in neither case is he accused of doing anything illegal. Reporting live tonight, Tarrant County, Todd Unger, Channel 8 News. All right, Todd, thank you. And some strong words tonight from local members of the GOP. The chairman of the Ellis County Republican Party said Barton's lifestyle is inconsistent with Republican ideals. And State Senator Connie Burton called for Barton's resignation, writing, we must hold public officials to a high standard, and recent publicized incidents demonstrate those standards were not met.